Oh, hello Hamilton, it's Dan from DeWilt Chrysler here, sitting in a 2020 Ram Limited 1500 pickup truck with a 12 inch display screen for you that we're gonna show you all the operational features, as many as we can in depth, because the technology here is incredible, as you will see. So we're going to start off with the radio. We're going to get out of nav, hit the media button, and we can see we've got a bunch of different options here. We have AM, FM, Bluetooth. We don't want Bluetooth. And we're going to go to select source, and we're going to hit Sirius Radio. Right now we're on Matchbox 20, and this is Pop Rocks. And I really don't like Pop Rocks, so I'm going to show you how to change that. And we can go, oh, there's a great station, the Beatles, one of my favorites. I love the Beatles and we're going to try to hold that to number one and we just program that to number one because the Beatles rock. And I can show you audio buttons where we can go for the uh, fade, four corner fade or we can go into the equalization mode. Everything is touch screen here to get your ample perfect sound whatever you like. With this 19 speaker Harman Kardon, listen, wow. So now we're going to show you some climate controls. We go to the bottom toolbar and we hit climate. As you can see, it displays our ventilation system. We can choose whichever one we like for direction of ventilation. Here's our sink functionality. That's our sink button. If I change the temperature, you can see both are changing at the same time. So the driver has that control to sync up the temperatures to the left and the right side for passenger and driver. We have fan speeds, of course, and we're gonna turn that off. So if we want to hit the uh, more controls, we've brought up all the interior uh, options for heated seats, vented seats, heated steering wheel, passenger has the same thing, and vented seats on their sides. So we have multiple functions. Everybody can have their total comfort when they desire. So the apps here, there's a number of apps as you can see. We have climate control centers, we have travel link. Here's a surround camera for you. What does that mean? Well, we have cameras all around the vehicle. Mirror dimmer, that's for headlight systems. Like if somebody's got high beams in the back, you can control that and reflect the lights back out of your eyes and your vision. Now we're gonna show you the navigation system. We got the big display up. We hit the toolbar where to and we want to go and search. And I've preset 1600 Main Street, but I did that by punching the keys here on our keyboard, 1600 Main Street. I touch it and it'll take me there. It's searching. Touch it again to make sure we get there. Go route here. It displays the route and then we're gonna say go. Please proceed to the highlighted route. And it'll take me to where I wanna go. If I wanna clear this, Go to stop guidance on our toolbar on the top right corner. Hit stop guidance, stop guidance, and it clears off our screen. And right now I'm gonna show you how to pair a phone, how easy it is on all of our products. We hit the toolbar on the bottom, we go to phone, and we said it asked me, do I want to pair a phone? Yes, I do. So I want to pair this phone, and uh, it shows me a pin, and I go to Bluetooth here, Show, set it up, hit the Bluetooth. It's pulled up the Uconnect that we're looking for. We press the Uconnect system, it's downloading. It says, it's asking me, do I want to pair with the pin numbers that are matching from the screen and the phone? And I'll say yes, and I'll say yes. And it's gonna pair now, and we're paired. And now it's gonna download all your contacts, and we allow that, we say okay press and hold for voice button to the steering wheel to activate Siri. Not at this time, but we can do that. So now that we've paired the phone, there's another great system in this truck. We have a cable free charging system. And all we do is take our phone, slide it in the uh, appropriate spot, and it should start charging this phone very soon. And we'll know by the light coming on, the blue light, which just showed up. Now we have a wireless charging system for your phone while you're doing your everyday activity. And now we're gonna show you how to bring up Apple CarPlay. We have our iPhone, our hard cable, which must be inserted into the USB port. 
hit our toolbar on the Bluetooth phone. It'll show you our Apple CarPlay displays. And we have a number of features here. We have maps, we have messages, phone. Isn't that terrific? Remember, you have to have your cable in with your iPhone to bring up all those features for Apple CarPlay. And now let me show you the home screen. The home button shows you the split screens and how you can choose your different selections. For example, I like to see music on top and temperatures and controls on the bottom. That's my preference. You can do your own. So we can X these out and you should go back to the split screen. And if we go back to the home button, it'll take us to the previous page where I was. There you have it, some of the features on the 12-inch screen in a random limited.